uh, you know, a hard-fought basketball game. Really proud of our guys. We, we compete. Uh, we don't quit. We had chances, I thought, uh, throughout the course of the game where, you know, we had a seven, eight-point lead uh, at different points and, and didn't push it to 12, 14, 15. Uh, we're, you know, a young team going to make a couple mistakes, uh, turnover, turnover, bad shot, uh, and allow them to, you know, they'll, they'll hit some bombs on you. And, and uh, they closed the gap too many times. And, uh, you know, they were in, definitely in the driver's seat uh, coming down the stretch. But, you know, we didn't quit and uh, kept competing and kept attacking. And uh, I don't think we made a lot of shots tonight. I thought we got good looks and, and we didn't knock a lot of threes down. Uh, we did a great job of being aggressive and getting to the foul line, getting to the basket. And, and I love how hard we competed tonight. Coach, in terms of that last play that you drew up, did you like the shot that Buddy had, or could you understand why he maybe passed that one up? Yeah, I thought he had a good look there at the top of the key. When you uh, struggle at the three-point line like you're talking about, and if you get some late, but to stay with a team like that when it's not falling from deep, just how big of a kind of better is that? No, it's good. I mean, there's no, you know, consolation prize for losing. Uh, it's still a loss, but, you know, uh, we're, we're proud of our guys, and uh, we're going to keep shooting them. We're going to keep running. We uh, want to keep spacing the floor, uh, keep attacking the rim. Uh, you know, we're learning. That's a good team, and they, they obviously they're a good team. It goes without saying, but their experience. Um, they don't they don't make two or three mistakes in a row. You'll you'll very rarely get them to make two two in a row. So, uh, you know, they're a tough out. They got us four times this year, and, and uh, you know, hopefully next year. Um, you know, get it to two and two or three and one because we were in. You know, those were I thought four really, really good games against them, and that stinks that we're zero and four. Can Coach, even... I know that you're still trying to integrate three players that are, are new. Um, does that have anything to do with kind of just the looking at a different option in the starting lineup tonight? Uh, no. Steph Curry bust away, bust out with a 10, 11 threes. Uh, just, was it just a matter of him, you know, being in the right spots, you know, to get those shots on? Well, I mean, you know, I think he got two of them on Marvin, um, and that's just the experience. As Marvin gets older, you know, he's what he does is he, he rocks you to sleep, and he wants that space and gets his feet behind the three-point line. He got he got a couple there. Uh, they do a great job of cutting and uh, and screening for him. Um, you know, the ball go in the post, and now it's you know with Demarcus it's even worse because he's such a, such a threat. Uh, and they and they run what's called post splits, and they get good. They're very good screening and that experience that I was talking about was really able to, you know, they've seen everything you can do you know, and, and all the different schemes and, um, you know, they play well together. They're well coached. Steve does a great job and, and uh, you know, he's put 10 on us before and, and several teams in the league, but I like, you know, we didn't, we didn't stop fighting. We, we kept coming at them. A lot of middle runs tonight from both sides. What can you say about your team's poise tonight in the building that was pretty amped up? Yeah, I thought it was fun. I mean, I was sitting there at halftime. I told her, you know, that's, that's a heck of a basketball game. And there's some turnovers and stuff. Uh, but as far as the level of competition, uh, I think you, you, it's, it's a treat to be a part of, you know. Can you even allow yourself to think about what the playoff series would look like against these two teams based on, you know, last year's success, 2-2. Two and two. This year, no, you know, five points separate you guys. I think the largest margin would look like. No, right now we're not a playoff team, right? We're in ninth. So, no. When and if that happens, then yeah, that would be that'd be fun. In terms of making that adjustment in the starting lineup, is that just a, for tonight, or are you looking at something maybe going forward for a few games? That's what we're going to do going forward.